you wouldn't accept my stupid joke, but it was a good stupid joke, wasn't it? It was definitely a stupid one, yeah, that's for sure. Shut up. I didn't, I did, not gonna say it's good, no. I know you won't, because that's how you are about every one of my jokes. No, Steve, you're a yeah. fucking hit. Yeah, exactly. Fuck off. You know it already. Espen, you smell like dog treats, dude. Well, I already clicked the live button, so now that's gonna be on, on camera forever. Yeah, that you smell like kibbles and bits. Well, my, my name is uh, Strong Kibbles as well, you know. Yeah, Strong Kibbles, because the scent's so strong. You just spelt it wrong. It's that, Strong Kibbles. It's strong as in very strong. <laughs> very strong scent of kibble, dude. See, that was a pretty good joke. Yeah. So how many viewers do thousands? Tens of thousands. Jesus Christ. One million viewers. I just want to thank my cat and Rick and Morty for always getting me through the day. Oh, yeah. Without them, we couldn't have reached this many viewers. I'd also like to thank... You'd be a rock star oh on my God. Man, You gotta stop doing that, dude. Shut up, Espen. I'm trying doing my best i'm I trying loaded, I loaded up twitch just to help you out it's not on twitch oh god damn it it's not on twitch <laughs> no fuck why aren't you streaming twitch dude people can subscribe on twitch so or am i your only subscriber every month i think that's the, i, I think mean, I'm I'll, your only I'll, I'll take your money anyways but you know <laughs> dude i'm gonna have amazon prime no matter what for a while so i am definitely might, might as well you know subscriber get something out of It'll it. I'll always be your subscriber. That's so sweet of you. It sounds a little you, gay. Give but, me a uh, fucking money. Yeah. I I'll, I'll take the money. Oh. Yeah, don't do that. <laughs> don't, don't do that. I muted it. Good. Wait, 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 wait. Mute tap. Volume full. Okay. Now we're good. There you go, dude. Now I can watch you play. All right. What do we, what do we need? What, what, where did we end off? Wait, P for uh, photo mode, right? Yeah, and recam. So pretty much all we did was just, you know, this miniature little platform. We got our daily water droplet here and two more down under this branch. God, the controls for picture mode is annoying. But yeah, we got the do collector. We got a bunch of baskets, do the rack for drying stuff. You know, the, the basics. So we still need to build a proper house. All right. We need what? What can we build? We 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 gotta build a base. We need the cookery. We need weed stems and boiling gland for that. Don't we have a boil, boiling gland already? Apparently not. Did we use that on a, something? I don't remember, dude. We need more spinners. We need a bit of crude rope. So I'm gonna make king sap collector. A bad spot. The perfect spot, dude. I thought for a moment I heard the sound of a freaking uh will spider dude that was just through your microphone and what else the noise outside yeah. the room yeah honestly dude i think what we need the most right now is just a proper mini startup house somewhere so well there's that where do we do that where do we want to our first house our first like proper house well let's be real aspen there's a ton of grass all around us. Yeah, that's easy to gather since we're close to it. Yeah. But don't we want to be on a higher ground? I mean, we want to be a bit higher, but, you know, if we take the upper yard, we're not even at, at that point yet, you know. Where are we going to need to... Where's our middle location on the map? <laughs> the tree. Like, absolutely middle. If you are to zoom out 100%. It is right next to the field station. Oh, it's the field station I usually usually go to on on the opposite side of this uh, uh, garden light thing over here. You know that turns on at night. Yeah. On the other side of that, that looks uh, approximate like the middle. The middle of the map to me. I mean, it depends. The map is not completely square, anyways. You know, so. No, no. Oh, I think thirsty. this time. Drink. Maybe we should consider. We gotta consider where where the enemies are, dude. Yeah, there's a lot of enemies right where you're pointing, dude. Not closer to the shore, though. In that area, if we're closer to the shore, all we get is the mosquitoes at night. And spiders. Spiders, 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 and more spiders. So, you see, there's a spider right down there. That roams around in this area as well, dude. Yeah, yeah, I know. But I was thinking, literally... 
Maybe. And right maybe over there, just... right over here by that flower pot. Yeah. Wait, where did you go? Um, oh, you, right oh, you ran right, you ran over there. Okay. Uh, there is spiders as well, and mosquitoes have a tendency to land or right here. Yeah, <laughs> it's right in front of me, dude. Yeah. Yeah. What I was thinking was, you want to follow me? Yeah, I'll try. Don't want to trigger some mosquitoes. I'll stay in the water then. Take a second, swim across. You remember when we built our way up right there? Uh, yeah. You remember there being a bombarda beetle spawn? Right next to it? Yeah, I, I remember us having to fight some stuff just to build our way up. But, now, look at your map really quick. Now that we're right here. Look at your map. This is kind of the middle, dude. The middle is further back. A little bit. But, I mean, damn close to it, and look at all this grass, and look at up there's the shed, and back there's the beehive, and straight ahead's the tree. This seems nice, does it not? It does seem nice. It seems like we're kind of looking at it all, but we already know there's a spawn right, right over here, where we can see this guy. Yeah, so, so we don't, we don't want to get too close to it either. Yeah, we want to be back here more. And there's a big ass rock we could build up onto that rock. I'm seeing some things. Good, because I'm not seeing much yet. Because I don't know exactly how safe this area is. Uh, Bombarda beetles here. spawn under there. And spiders further back here. Uh, we got a Bombarda beetle over there by Frankenstein. And... I mean, you know how little I'm scared of those things, though. Look at all this grass. We have a thistle thing right here. We got an apple spawn right next to us, though. Yeah, thistle fucking tree right here. That's what? This is non-stop ammo for your boy. Yeah, because you decided you want to be a, a ranger of this one. I've been enjoying it. I will switch up, but for now, this ranger shit. Do you not like that I'm a ranger? Eh, I mean. Some of the fights would be nice to have somebody else to take a little bit of aggro as well. Yeah, I could, uh, I could switch it up again. No, you just, gotta... you know, just have a, a decent weapon on you at all times. Mainly a style, so you can, you know. I need my spear then, dude. You, you, just a regular spear? You don't even have a single one on you? I have a regular one, but I, oh, I need my... Uh... Wait, what is up with that spider? Why is it jumping? It's completely tweaking out, dude. He got uh, a glitch spider. Yeah. Well, it's not a bad spot, but I would s say it feels more. Honestly, it feels more like the entrance down here onto a buoyant kind of thing. You want to do a buoyant, dude? But when if we make a base right over where we made a base last time, we're gonna be having uh, wolf spiders roaming around us. That's that's a big issue. We can deal with regular spiders and bombarder beetles. But bombarder beetles deal sort of, you know, explosive AOE attacks. And though if they can sh see us, they'll shoot at us. Whereas oh. spider will try to get up to us, but can't. That's true. What are you suggesting, my guy? Because I just gave the suggestion. None of this is like a let's do it. Well, honestly, the edge of the upper yard is really nice. But we gotta get up there first. And I see you getting attacked by bombarda beetles. Don't even yeah, need to boil it. I fell. I mean, maybe it's not such a bad idea. We just gotta stick to around, you know, this edge right here well, along the water, well, and, and try and last, try and build that... building a hanging section up over the water. Yeah, I think it's a great idea. This right here is as flat as our old base right here. Yeah, and that right there is. You don't see the spider right next to you? <laughs> My dude, come here. There's four or five of them. Yeah, yeah. You, what? You're, you're wondering why I'm skeptical about this this base placement? I mean, they're sleeping. Not forever. Dude, this makes me wish we had those bomb things, remember? Uh, unload bombs on them. I mean, and if we follow along this edge over here? go further this way we're gonna end up at stink bucks and then mosquitoes after that where do you suggest i know you want to do buoyant not necessarily i mean it's a it's well, a it's a pain to having to bring items over there when we don't have the two-way sibling yet well here's the thing is you haven't suggested spots it doesn't need to be in this area this was just my it's because i'm really thinking hard about which location but there is things everywhere so 
we need a spot where whatever things are around us is the least worrying and honestly just a floating or hanging above the water foundation would maybe be nice but i just feel like it's not even cool it's, it's, it's not even cool dude come on we need something good buoyant foundation isn't cool not really i mean it's probably a bit safer i think it'd be nice i kind of prefer the other side of the pond don't know why maybe because we played there last time and because i just like approaching the water right here i like this i feel like we could build a dock straight out and then a base like well where right. is the uh under this frisbee is that where the uh, entrance to the s underground thing no thought it was we need a, a place that's close to a uh fucking uh field station is there not one over here I thought there was. No, it's it's the lab. Gotta go to the lab then. Let's check the map. It does not look like there's any field stations. There's just enemies everywhere. Maybe we'll just... I mean, it's it's not necessarily our forever base. But, you know, we just need something. So maybe right here is, is good enough. Well, dude, I'd want you to pick a spot. I don't want to just say good enough. But I'll tell you what. While you're thinking, I'm going to start shopping. Because I've been looking at this grass too long. You've been looking at the grass for too long, dude. We're gonna at least start a buoyant dock here at the minimum. We don't need a base. Oh, you need. Well, I think you need more materials for buoyant, don't you? Might want to you need. You don't even need regular gra grass, dude. You need berry leather, silk, and eel grass. Berry leather, silk, yeah. eel grass. That sounds fucking hard. It doesn't sound like stuff that we want to go collect them. Nope. So maybe not so much buoyant. At all. Maybe that's why we did the castle, dude. Why? Because we uh only did so many buoyants, and then we built the structure on top of the buoyant. So it was like a really big building, but not as much buoyant shit. Yeah. Sorry. I'm making a pile here, and you're just trying to take me out. Yeah, totally. Every time I drop this grass, oh my god, you just keep... You know what? Why are you so quick? What do you mean? I feel like you did this. Not necessarily. Do you have the grass cutter perk yet? Yep. I don't. Surprisingly. It's you. The roles have been reversed this time around us. Oh yeah, right. Slowly just, you know, building, not buoyant, but <laughs> onto a lily pad. That's kind of the same thing, you know? Oh really? No, it's not. Well, I mean, I, I didn't even think you could do that. Oh, you didn't? No. All right. After we've made a little miniature base thing here where we can stand a little bit more secure. I'm gonna take a little short break. You got any food? Uh, yeah. Sir? Rub time. You know what? We could really have used our freaking uh, platform dry grass, crude rope, and pebbles. I can get the dry grass. I can get the pebbles. Okay, okay. Don't. <laughs> Don't. Did I hit you? No, but it looked like you were trying to hit me. Oh, no. You were aiming for me, dude. I was not aiming for you. My leg might have been a little bit more tremendous. Yeah, whatever. Blame it on the lag. Are you done with that dry grass soon? It takes forever, apparently. You take forever. Apparently. Well, I'll tell you what. I'll tell oh, you dude. what. Just built the goddamn thing, dude. Oh, inventory's full. Oh, wait, that was a dandelion. Didn't want to... Bullshit. Ton of hey, remember the the old way we transported materials? How'd we do it? We both grabbed the, the thing and then one person moved it. Oh yeah. And then yeah. we moved it back. I wonder if that's still a thing, dude. I think it might be. Oh, I think maybe randomly throwing your weapon in the <laughs> completely wrong direction is still also a thing. Yeah. Grass master. Oh, you finally got it. Yeah. It's Lollipops. That spider is a bit too close over here, dude. Alright, I got 45 dry grass. Plenty, dude. We needed a tiny bit just to just to build a few platforms for grass. We didn't need this much. Well, I got 45. Well, you got 45. You're not gonna... No land rights. Why didn't you move it? I tried and it said no land rights. What? I don't know what that means. Well, neither do I. Water filtration tablets needed. Right, I just need the tiniest box to stand in for safety, dude. All right, my guy, you're gonna go take a break. Yep. I'm gonna load out and then load back in. Or wait, can I do that? Game repair. There we go. Pack. I'm I'm sitting in a nice little box here. 
All right. See you in a couple of minutes, dude. All right.